Hello, Ali Turners. This is Timur with this week's trading report. Uh, before we get on with the trading report this week, I'd like to inform you of one little change that we've made from this week onwards in our trading report format. Uh, we will not be disclosing uh, the account number, the trading account numbers anymore, as I expressed in my last video, that um, you know some people tried to access our accounts. Now, those people uh, may have uh, some bad intentions, we don't know. But again, to protect your funds, um, to absolutely protect your funds, it's, you know, it's imperative that we hide these account numbers so no one can access these account, account details or can get uh, some you know, uh, malicious account access. Now, uh, Everything else remains the same. You'll be able to see that we are connected to an ECN server. Um, and I'll explain this to you while we go through our trading accounts. What is the difference between an ECN account and what is the difference between an ECN account and a non-ECN account? Uh, so let's get on with the trading report of this week. Uh, uh, our tier one deposits this week uh, reached uh, $1,736,000 and our tier two deposits uh, crossed Two million six hundred and fifty-eight thousand dollars. Our total deposits have crossed four million three hundred and ninety-five thousand dollars. <throat> Our uh, target in tier one was one hundred and seventy-three thousand six hundred and thirty-eight dollars, and a target in um, tier two was three hundred and ninety-eight thousand eight hundred and thirty-nine dollars. So let's um, go through all the trading accounts one by one and see how we perform this week. Uh, so I'll move on to our trading terminal and I've already logged in to our first account but just to make sure that we are logging in to a light forex ECN account this is imperative this is very very because of what's happened in the past couple of days and what's happened today always demand for a trading report and always make sure that you're connected that your trading accounts are connected with an ECN account so there's absolutely no ambiguity there's absolutely no doubt that your funds are actually being trading traded now what is the difference between an ECN account and a non ECN account in an ECN account the trading terminal the trading is connected directly to the liquidity provider and the funds are transferred to the liquidity provider so essentially we are trading directly with the banks the funds are sent to the liquidity provider and not held with the broker whereas in a non ECN account which is also called a uh, trading desk account the, the funds are held with the broker and they can um, pretty much do anything they want with it um, so to make sure that your funds are secure we have uh, been trading in, in ECN accounts apart from one classic account that we had that we will be moving to um, ECN account only one uh, one of our accounts were classic accounts, but we will be moving that classic account into an ECN account this week. Also, we've changed uh, some of our trading accounts. Uh, we've switched um, onto new trading accounts to make sure that we are not trading on the old ones. So those uh, with bad intentions cannot have access to those accounts. <clears throat> so let's have a look at this account, uh, the account number one. Uh, <clears throat> as you can see that we've logged in. I'm going to see our performance in last week. Last week from 30th until today. And as you can see that uh, we have made a total profit of uh, $228,992 this week. So we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this before moving on to our next account, which is account number two. The account number two. Now, this is more work for me because, uh, you know, we have to hide the account numbers and I cannot, uh, you know, simply uh, log into uh, the accounts just by, um, you know, account number two or three. So I have to see which account number I'm logging in from a piece of paper. So we we'll log into uh, our next account, which is this one. Again, it's an ECN account. Let's have a look at this account. System period, and we'd like to see how we performed from 30th until today. As you can see, that we made a total profit of $54,150 in this account. So we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this before moving on to our next account, 
which is account number three. Uh, right. So we'll log into account number three here. And we'll see how we performed last week. 30th until today. As you can see that we made a total profit of $228,045 on this account. So we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this before moving on to our next account where we did not trade this week. This is the one we are switching um, to a new trading account. Uh, this is one of the old accounts, but we'll be moving to a new trading account from next week on. Uh, account number four. Uh, from 30th until today now as you can see that we did not trade in this account did not make any profits we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this before moving on to our next account which is account number five here it is and this is one of the classic accounts and we will not be trading in this account from this week on we'll be switching the funds to a new ECN account and we'll trade from this week on we'll trade in all ECN accounts all right let's have a look at this account you can see it's light for a classic light forex classic account let's have a look at the trading trading history for this week As you can see that we made a total profit of $34,000 on this account this week. So we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this before moving on to our uh, last account. Uh, we've limited ourselves to six accounts from this week on, uh, which is account number six, which is right here on this terminal. Uh, it's already logged in, but just to make sure that we are logging in to a Light Forex ECN account. There we go. And we're going to see our trading history for this week. And you can see that we made a total profit of $73,650 on this account. So we'll go back to our Excel sheet and highlight this one before seeing our total performance this week. We made a total profit of $618,837, um, which is $46,359. So we were able to pay commissions at 3% this week. Now remember, uh, we always pay commissions out of the extra profits we make. Uh, I keep telling you guys, I uh, keep reminding you guys that we always uh, pay commissions for this week. Uh, we are paying commissions on deposits make, made last week. So this week, this, week, this week we were able to make $46,359 extra profits. So we could afford to pay 3% extra, 3% uh, commissions this week. Our commissionable deposits were $1,084,000 this week. So we've paid these commissions. And we are left with the company profit of $30,832, out of which $6,916 is um, added to our insurance fund and $6,916 goes towards the admin, admin cost of Elite Tennis Club. Our insurance fund has reached $84,376. I'd like to remind you that as soon as we reach $100,000, we'll add another trading account to our trading report where we will trade our insurance funds with very very low risk strategies and low returns there will be no targets in that account but we will be able to increase our uh, insurance fund this is very important that we increase our insurance fund to protect your profits and try to pro protect your capital as well and uh, or I, will, I would also like to remind you that we always trade with almost 70% of, of the total funds. We keep 30% in reserves. Uh, we only expose 70% to the market and out of those 70%, we only expose around a maximum of 25 to 30% uh, to trading. <clears throat> 
So this is it. This is uh, this week's trading report. I'll be doing a live video in the group tomorrow to uh, you know answer a few concerns that have been raised after whatever's happened in the market in, um, during the past couple of uh, days and today. Uh, but again, the only one thing that I'm going to stress on is that we will keep focusing on our work. We will keep doing what we do here. Uh, without uh, giving in to any negativity. Negativity is not an option for us. You know, um, it's just not an option. We'll keep doing what we do and we'll keep progressing and we will prove to you that EEC is the number one. You all have a good weekend, guys, whatever's left of it, and I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.